So we continue with the consonants, the consonants that sound alike, sound very close. A lot of times because those consonants are pronounced in the same place in the mouth or in the throat or on the lips. The two consonants that we're look, looking at now, let me share my screen with you, is the G and the K. G, K, G, unvoiced, K, voiced. G, K. All right, so the G, the hard G, and the K or the hard C, because the hard C is pronounced like the K. So let's look at the G, K. And you can see once again, when someone is speaking quickly or not being careful of their pronunciation, how one could be pronounced in place of the other. Angle, ankle. Hag, hack. Beg, beck. Bigger, bicker. Bug, buck. Peg, peck. Boogie, bookie. You can see I'm not having problems. But that's because I'm being very conscious of how I'm pronouncing. But you could see how one could be pronounced in place of the other very easily, very, very easily. Lag, lack. Jag, jack. Guard, card. Gwyn, Quinn. Great, Crate. Ming, Mink. Clog, Clock. I'm being very careful in how I'm pronouncing these words. Ghost, coast. Gab, cab. Jag, jack, jack, jack. Excuse me. Wags, wax. Now here I have the X when it sound when it sounds like an K S when the sound is K S. So I don't have a K there, but that X sounds like a K S and it's the minimum pair for wags, wax. Meager, meeker. Gave, came. Lags, once again, it's the X, the K, S sound, lats. Bag, back. Ling, link. Grease, crease. Gage, cage. Glamour. Both of these are the British uh, spellings. Glamour, clamor. But I'm used to spelling it like this because depending on the generation, the British as well as the American spelling is acceptable. Gain, cane. 
Gran Cram. Now here you notice, I think in a couple others too, that I don't have the K, but I have the hard C. Same pronunciation as the K, but you can't exchange it. You can't spell it K-R-A-N. Um, the person wouldn't know what it is. Yeah, the speaker wouldn't, the English speaker wouldn't know what it is, even though the sound is the same. <coughs> Excuse me. Gate, Kate. Tags, tax. The X equals the KS sound. Gallery, calorie. You wouldn't think that they would have anything in common, wouldn't you? But they do. Gallery, calorie. Gain, cane. You saw the other cane, the C A I N E, which was the name in the Bible. And this is Cain, the thing you walk with because um, you need help with walking. Sags, sax, saxophone. Gold, code. Glad, clad. Garrett, carrot. Grave, crave. Vigor, vicar, vicar. Vigor, this is the American spelling, V I G, not O U R, but V I G O R, vicar. Glass, class. Gap, cap. Ground, crown. You wouldn't think these two things had, these two words had that much in common as far as pronunciation. The only difference is the G and the C. Gold, cold. Glue, clue. Game, came. Gary, carry. Garrett, carrot. Ping, pink. Gamma, comma. Sags, sacks. Figs, fix, that XKS sound. But Lee, oh, there I am mixing this up again with the F versus the V. Oh, you have extra. Okay, so we're talking about the blah, 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 blah. We'll give another word that's much, yeah. We're talking about the G versus the K. Game, K. And you notice the K here, it's the sound. It's not the actual letter. These are minimum pairs. And once again, when you're speaking like I'm speaking, I'm speaking one word carefully after the other word. You can hear the difference without any problem. And you can make the difference in your mouth. But when people are speaking the way they normally speak, these sounds can get confusing. So I want to thank you for coming to my video, for watching my video, for sharing the video, and for subscribing. Hopefully you will subscribe so that I can get as many people as possible. Let me stop sharing. Thank you very much. <clears throat> have a good evening or have a good day, depending on when you see this. Have a good day and um, hope that you continue watching the videos. Bye-bye, have a good day.